What up, YouTube? It's your boy, Fatal J. Back at it like I love something. And I'm glad you're here. I'm glad you're looking at this beautiful, ugly mug on your screen. Thank you so much. I want to give a shout out comment to my boy, the movie Raider. Every time I look in the comment, he's there bringing those fiery, beautiful gems. And I absolutely love it. And before we get into business, I'm working on a secret ninja project. Yes, I am. If you don't believe me, check this out. One, two, three. Yeah. If you want to know what I'm working on in the description below in my description box, make sure you join my email list and you will find out what I'm working on. It's going to be dope. Trust me. You know, I can bring that pain when it comes to martial arts and ninja and all that Kung Fu jazz. Check that out. Now, what we're going to be talking about today, we're going to be talking, to, talking about is Josh Whedon, Justice League, still canon. We're going to talk about if it's still canon, but I want you to check out this picture real fast before we get into that. David Ayers just dropped a black and white picture just like Zack Snyder used to do. It's the picture of Joker. Now, you know how this boat goes. You remember Zack Snyder was doing it. He was leaking all that unreleased footage that we never seen before. Leaking those photos we never seen before that was in the Snyder Cut. Now David Ayers is doing it too. A lot of people out there don't think the David Ayers Suicide Squad Cut is coming out. It's coming out. It's coming out. When he, he following Zack Snyder trends, baby. You know? It's coming. It's coming. And it's going to be so dope because the David Ayer cut is like a prelude to the Snyder cut. It got ties in there. They were trying to tie it like the MCU. They were trying to tie everything together to give us that Snyderverse DC Universe connection, you know? But let's get to the topic at hand. Josh Whedon. Is Josh Whedon Justice League canon? Now, this is the thing about it. Josh Whedon, if you really do your research, Josh Whedon is feeling salty about the Snyder Cut. Why? I don't have no clue. But based on one of his posts on Twitter, when he was making fun of the release the Snyder Cut hashtag, you can tell that he's salty. Now, to me, as a director, understanding, creating, and making art, if I was a director, and I was the one that remade Zack Snyder's film. I still would want Zack Snyder's original version to come out. My version is already out. But I want the director to get his masterpiece out there too. It's called art. It's called creativity. Why would you be salty about that? Unless you have that in your heart already. Sometimes it's not all about me and you. It's about other people too. Give Zack Snyder a chance and get his vision out there too. You know, your stuff will get overlapped. Of course, because the Zack Snyder hype is too high. But people will give you more props if you show some love. Now, back to my original question. Is Josh Whedon Justice League canon? Yes, it is. I believe so. This is the reason why I believe. And I can back this up. The way the DC is going to handle movies from now on after the Snyder Cut, because the Snyder Cut is going to change the game. Trust and believe. What they're going to do, they're going to continue with your Wonder, Wonder Woman 84s, your Shazam 2, your Aquaman 2, your uh, Matt Reeves Batman. They're going to continue on that road on the silver screen. But on the other hand, with the HBO Max, you're going to have your Snyderverse. Okay, after that Snyder, Snyder Cut come out, you might get a Flash movie. You might get a, a, a Batman movie with Ben Affleck. <laughs> it's going to be that way. You're going to have two universes going on. And it's not going to be like that CW stuff. I'm sorry. I'm sorry if I'm hurting some feelings and I can feel the darts being thrown at me now. But that CW stuff is mad cheesy. Yes, I like the first few seasons of Arrow and Flash, but that's where it stops. <laughs> that's where it stops 
So to answer your question is Josh Whedon, Justice League canon. It's canon. It's canon on the big movie screen. But what matters to us is what goes on on HBO Max. And I truly believe that their David Ayer cut is going to be on HBO Max too. That's going to be the Snyderverse. I'm telling you guys, let me know what you think about my thoughts. Let me know in the comments below. Let me know if you consider Josh Whedon version canon. Do you think it's PC to say it's canon? Or do you think the Josh Whedon version doesn't matter at all? Also, make sure to like, make sure to subscribe, and make sure to join my Ninja Patreon. I'm telling you, you're going to unlock some rewards. You're going to unlock secret YouTube tips. You're going to unlock dope motivational images. Make sure to join my Patreon because even being a well, a white belt in my Ninja Clan uh, Patreon, you're going to help this channel so much. Guaranteed. One dollar makes this channel great thank you so much get back at your boy fader j and bald headed man you already know what to say Ninja the time for talking is over it's time to push buttons